Hey guys. Long time no see. Long time no me recording. So, I'm back. I'm back. Okay. Hopefully I'm back for good, but I'm back. <laughs> so, I'm trying to vlog today. I did a video since my last birthday. My birthday last year. I don't even remember. But it's been forever. And let me give y'all a little update. So, my hair. I'll show y'all my hair in a minute. But, let's do a little tattoo update. And on my old phone. So, this is my 13 Pro Max. So, I'm going to try to be vlogging on my old phone. We're going to see how this one come out. Hopefully... It comes out good, but I don't know what the heck I'm doing today. <sighs> life has just been life -ing. I'm sure it's been life for everybody. So, yeah. As y'all can see, I think y'all already know I got my septum pierced. That's been a while. I got another tattoo. I don't know if I showed y'all mine over matter. But I had got this one, mine over matter. What else did I get? Oh, yeah. I always forget about this one. I got Divine Feminine right here. And I got this matching one. Holy crap. Oh. I got this matching tattoo right here. And I might show y'all who I got the matching tattoo with later. We'll see. I don't know. So... Yeah, let's get into my freaking hair because I don't even know how to I don't even know how to vlog anymore. It's not light on, that's why it's so dark in here. My hair. So y'all probably wondering what's going on with your hair. I am officially a dreadhead. I have locks now. Yes. I have locks now. This is how my hair looks. And I think I have, I'm pretty sure I have 56 locks in my hair. And I got them done in um, April, April 11th. That's when I started my lock journey. So, oh. so I do not wear wigs anymore. I've just been wearing my hair um, when it's done or with a do-rag, aka I stay with my do-rag on, or what else do I do? I do my hair wraps too. So yeah, that's the only thing I'll be doing because I'm a dreadhead. So, backstory. Somebody, okay, the person who I got the matching tat with they kept telling me oh yeah get locks get locks you should just get locks get locks get locks hold on y'all just kept telling me get locks get locks lock your hair you should just lock your hair already lock your hair lock your hair and then i'm just like okay because i got to a certain point with my hair where i did every single hairstyle like I did every single freaking hairstyle that I could do to my hair and I was natural for like five six years I don't even remember when I stopped getting relaxers aka perms I don't remember when I stopped but I know I was relaxed I mean I was natural for like some years like you could go back to my old videos I've been relaxed I have 4c hair so I would just have my fro but I would never freaking wear my real hair. Like, I would never wear my real hair out. I didn't wear my hair out for years because I just wasn't comfortable wearing my hair out. Because, I don't know. I feel like I didn't want to wear my hair because I think I had just trauma from my hair. Like, trauma from when I got bullied about my hair. So, like, years ago in high school, so I just stopped wearing my hair. Anytime I wore my hair out, 
I would only wear in like protective styles and wigs. That's all I did. Wigs and protective styles. Wigs and protective styles. Wigs and protective styles. Like nonstop. And then I got to the point with my natural hair when I'm like, okay, I had two options. I was like, I'm either going to lock my hair or I'm going to relax my hair. Stupid, stupid decision is the one I went with. So I relaxed my freaking hair, which I have a TikTok on it. Go follow my TikTok. They yell Renee with three E's. So I relaxed my hair. It was fine and cute. I did the little ponytails and it was, my hair was like down here. But then it got to a certain point where I'm like, why did I relax my hair? Like, it wasn't even necessary for me to relax my freaking hair. Like, that was just a stupid decision. So, I'm literally just like, I'm, I literally got to the point where I just was wearing protective style so much. To the point where I was like, if I did get locks and my locks grew, like, down here, it would look like really cute. Like, I, I really love the two strand twist on me, which I have pictures I can show y'all what. I love the two strand twist on me. And. Yeah. I was just like. I'm kind of over my hair right now. And then I got to a certain point. When I stopped relaxing my hair again. So maybe about. Three months in. To the relaxer. I was like eh. I don't even know why I did this stupid decision. But I did it. It is what it is. I wish I I have a grant doing it. So there's that. But I stopped relaxing my hair and then I waited, I think, three, four months. And that's when I finally asked um the loctician. I was like, I think I wanna lock my hair now. So I did in April. And that's when I'll just insert like the pictures and stuff for my hair when I first got it done. But yeah, I was just like I'm, I'm going back natural, and this is how my hair looks. This is it. Of course, I, I did my own retwist this month, but I usually let her do it, cause I was just like, I'm not really doing nothing this month, so why? I don't. I didn't feel like I really, really needed it professionally re retwisted, but since I'm at the beginning stages of my locks, it's best to keep getting them retwisted. Now, when you get to a certain length. It's like you can go long without a retwist. But yeah. So, this is how my hair looks. Ooh, it kind of itches. And do I regret getting my locks? Absolutely not. Like, at first it took a little bit for me to get used to because um, I had some decent... My hair was a decent length from the years that I was relaxed. It was a decent length. I wish I would have just went straight into the locks, but I didn't. So, do I regret going natural? Absolutely not. I feel like it took me getting used to my hair, but I feel like I'm at the place now where I'm kind of even more into my spiritual journey. Like, I kind of like fell into it. Oh, look at my little picture. I love that picture. But yeah, I like fell into my spiritual journey, but now that I got my locks and I'm officially done wearing wigs and weaves, I mean, you can still put on a wig with your locks. Like, as y'all can see, my hair is so short, I could throw on a wig right now, but I got to the point where I'm just like, I don't care to even wear a wig and weave. Now, I'm not going to say I don't do my lashes. I'm still doing my lashes. I'm still... Loving my makeup. <clears throat> but as far as me wanting to cover my natural hair anymore, um, I'm not doing it. Because at first I felt uncomfortable. But I'm at the stage now where I'm just like, it is what it is. I don't really wear my hair out like this. Not gonna lie, because I'm not at, I don't think I'm at the cutest stage. But I do, I either wear my hair out. When it's um freshly retwisted, a good week, two weeks, or I just wear my do rags, uh, wear my do rags, you know, or I do my mainly when I'm getting dressed up, I do my um head wrap, which I only have two. I need to get some more, but 
because I thought it was pointless to get white because white gets dirty fast, but yeah. So this is my hair wrap. And the hair wraps are cute. Do I regret going natural? I mean, going back natural? No. Do I regret getting my hair locked? No. Sometimes I do be missing little ponytail and stuff, but I'm just like, seeing all the styles I can do with locks, I don't really regret it. Like, I just feel different. Like, I'm in a different era within myself. So, yeah. I'm in a different era. And I'm happy about it. I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm a-okay. You know? Like, I don't really feel like I care to cover up my hair no more. I did hit a... I remember when I was thinking about getting them. I, I got to a point where I was like, I'm too scared. I don't want to do it. <clears throat> but I ended up... Be, something happened with my very first appointment. It was like an emergency with the person who did my hair and then i just got to another point where i'm like no you know what i'm doing it so this is my commitment and i want to do more videos on my hair and my advice to anybody who's thinking about getting their hair locked do it <laughs> i don't think anybody anybody who says that they got locks i mean maybe some people i've seen people cut theirs off start over or just comb theirs out. I don't think I'm going to ever get to that point. I'm sorry. It's I've done everything else with my hair. So yeah. But I just feel like it looks better. Like I do not miss putting on wigs non-stop. Like it takes me no time to do my hair now. Like I literally could throw on a wig cap. Maybe do my edges. And then that's it. Like, I don't regret, <clears throat> I don't regret doing this. And I would tell any other girl to stop wearing the wigs and weaves too. I mean, it is, everybody has their preference, you know. But I used to be the wig and weave queen, like, hello. I was the freaking, I loved it. And now I'm at a point where I'm just like, I don't even need it, like, and I feel like if you are going to do wigs and weaves, go back to the sew-in days. Like, go back to the sew-ins. I feel like wigs in this this type, in the summertime, gluing them on, the crab would look stupid when I look back at pictures. Because I feel like I never got really, really good at it. Like, but yeah, this is the start of a new vlog. This vlog is going to be love yourself and why you should get locks. Because, why not? <laughs> my hair looks crazy. But yeah, I love my hair now. I can't believe I'm saying I love my hair. But, I literally love my hair now. I never used to like my hair. Like, especially if you have 4C hair. We are like, we're the people who... <clears throat> Who like get it the worst. Because it's just like. It's that stereotype. It's that um freaking. Self hate. And now I'm just feel like. I'm doing the opposite. And I love my hair. And I'm not cutting it. And I'm not wearing no more wigs and weaves. Like I'm saving so much money now. I sold all my wigs. So yeah. This is the start of a new vlog. Don't know what the heck I'm doing today. But I'm finna do my makeup. And I guess I could do an updated makeup routine. I don't know if it's gonna be in this video, probably in the next one. So yeah, I'll be back. I'm binge watching Bad Girls Club. Nothing special so far, but I'll be back to, I mean, probably when I'm back. I'll probably have my makeup done. So, yeah. I'll be back, though. I'll be back. Okay, y'all. So, I'm done getting ready. This is my outfit of the day. And my... My earrings and my... What was it? And I don't know. 
which person is here. Maybe this one. Put a pop of color. Which sides? Or I could do the DK and Y sides. Oh yeah. I don't think I told y'all I lost like 20 pounds. Take some pictures, but this is not my phone. <laughs> that I really didn't use it. So I'll be back when I'm ready to vlog, vlog, and I need to figure out what it is. Hold on. I kind of want to do the extra big, thick earrings. Okay guys, so So Might be going to A downtown restaurant That's the thing, when I go downtown I like to dress up a little bit fancier to be the same one. I don't know. So, yeah. probably gonna go to the flea market, which I haven't been to the flea market like since I was like little, like really little. But everybody, I don't know. Let's see if I see anything there. But it's just to go. So, since I don't feel like rushing, I'm just not 30. I'm probably gonna start doing my makeup. And I don't know what the heck to wear. I think I'm either gonna wear, um, I'm running low on clothes. Um, summer clothes. Like, I thought I had a lot of summer stuff, but apparently not. Like, I usually, lately I've been ordering stuff from Shein, even though people be like, oh, it's so cheap. It's Shein, uh. Like, bro, I found everything that I got from Shein is cute. Like, I don't regret anything I got from Shein. I regret some stuff that I bought from Fashion Nova, like, to be honest. I haven't really even checked Fashion Nova because I'm just like, I'm not paying no... Who feels like paying an arm and... I mean, some people. But lately with Fashion Nova, I don't know. Like, I just haven't been... I could check on their nails to see if I see anything. But around my birthday when I was ordering stuff... I hated everything that I got for my birthday. Like, I literally have a whole outfit that I didn't even get to wear. I'm trying to think what else did I buy. Oh, wait. I don't even know how that would look. That freaking, um... Where the heck is my black skirt? I wish I had, like, a tube top or something. I don't know. But I'm most likely going to put on this black dress. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit when I'm done. And yes, I might record me doing my lashes next time I do them when I buy some more. So yeah. I don't know what I'm wearing. Most likely black. Because eh. I might have to get some more stuff from Shein. Like, I'm telling y'all, you get a decent amount from Shein. 
for cheap. If you want to order fashion over pretty little things, that's on y'all. Personally, I don't feel like I need to do that no more. Like, I'm sorry. Like, I'll literally be inching, putting the stuff in the cart, freaking, um... What else I be doing? Oh, yeah, look at the reviews. Like, duh. Even with Fashion Nova's reviews, I wish they would let people post the pictures on there so that you could see it on different body types and how it look or the material. That's the thing that I like about Shein also. You get to see the actual review, not just somebody typing what it is. Like, how am I supposed to know how I look? How's that look on me? Like, hello, I'm short. I'm like five, five one. 160 trying to be 150 but yeah like i'm petite short but i don't know whatever so yeah i'm gonna get ready and i'm gonna actually try to vlog vlog today because i didn't yesterday so i'll be back room is a mess from getting ready so this is what i'm wearing because i'm kind of bloated right now so i'm just like i wasn't with blue but i'm like let's just keep this in blue black with these sandals i wasn't with these sandals but i feel like these go a little bit more with the aesthetic you know so yeah uh, I'm gonna leave. Might take a shot. We got the sink. Oh, your favorite watches. <laughs> Look at these. No, I get one of these too. Spider Man. <laughs> oh, get this one. That's what the real. <laughs> I like this one better though.